Ok, pushback it is very simple. First we check that uh, the size is... Uh, so the size is greater than max size. So we check that is the allocated memory. So we push element right here, 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 here. So we push the element here. And if we want to push a new element, well element then it will show that uh, the size plus one, so for example in this case I don't know, uh, six plus one, which is seven, and if the max size is six, then it has to allocate a new memory. In this case it would happen which I showed here. First it would uh, create a bigger array, and then just copy the elements of that, deallocate the original memory, and make the address of array to the new uh, uh, place. This is just as simple as that. As we just simple and as not else because uh, even if it is gr greater than max size we just unlock a new memory and uh, after that we just simple set it to the value which we uh, passed here. Simple enough. And we uh, increase the size so uh, we will not uh, rewrite that value next time we pass something uh, simple as that. F okay, we use the operator so we could use it like a simple array. We just simple overwrite the operator, the array subscription operator, and with this we can use the return with and uh, we will use the return very simple we don't have to call member functions just this operator which is overloaded okay and this operator so array subscription always should be return the type of of what we store in this case it will store string but later when we rewrite it to a template we just simple uh, write the template variable here. Okay, uh, next, at this is very simple as it is very simple, just uh, uh, we check that uh, is it the correct place, so if i is l uh, less than v size, because it, if it is equal than v size, we have a problem because the index starts from zero, right? So if it is less, ju just return, as we threw an exception, I will talk about exception handling and then we will a little and then we will improve this program a little bit by through a class as an exception, not an integer number because it's uh, less nice. Okay. And here is the alloc new function as I I uh, spoke about that, I told about that, I talked about that. So in here we just simple make the size of double of the size. So we make it double, if it was 2 then we set it to 4, if it, if it is uh, 4 we set it to 8, if it is 8 we set to 16 and so on. We make a uh, pointer to a new integer array in the memory and then just copy all of the elements to it we delete so we deallocate the original memory and set the array pointer to the new uh, array pointer we just make it here so yeah this is just as simple as that okay uh, that should be pretty simple, we just return with the V size. Uh, so the size. Yeah, that's it. Although it starts from zero, so you should uh, return with minus one, but because we set, so we increase the size every time we pass, after we pass, uh, I uh, we should make a plus one after it. Uh, something like that, I think. So with this uh, should be uh, make it them uh, zero, so other zero. So we just return with v size. All right, we just make an operator plus equal to operator overloading. Uh, as I said, we will uh, 
learn a little bit about operator overloading and uh, we just simple push back so we use another member function which I uh, told you earlier and we just return the pointer so we just return the indirected pointer to this indirected pointer mean this array we will return actually we return with a reference all right uh, that is other thing but I've uh, tried to explain that uh, you should be familiar uh, that why don't do why do we uh, put this line here then we just override everything yeah I talked about that so I think I don't talk about that and that program should be very familiar to you from the vector class and from the uh, whole basic class so not basic but C++ just very basic C++ okay so the or uh, so the basic C++ tutorial it should be very familiar to you alright then uh, mm, yeah this was the program and I think I explained it well although if not just leave a comment and ask me and maybe I could uh, answer that okay thank you for watching and have